Nikki here, who's uh, you're about to see, is being represented by Gloria Allred. Gloria Allred, don't trust anything she says. She's been the attorney for 800 sensationalistic cases. She's the one that's representing Tiger Woods' mistress, the one that comes out. And there's never been a Gloria Allred press conference where her client did not cry, okay? Not, rec- not in recorded history, right? And so, like, Tiger Woods' mistress will come out and go, Oh, Tiger, he abused me. I couldn't believe it, that he would use me for sex. By the way, I'll be stripping next to his golf. I'm not kidding. That's in the press conference. Oh, I you know, was terribly mistreated by Tiger, and I'll be doing a strip tease near where he's golfing, and my porno is coming out soon. So I don't trust anything Gloria Allred says. So take this with a huge grain of salt. And so the two issues are, is she a hypocrite? And if we believe, Nikki, that she's undocumented and was working for the Whitmans and, and was fired, and based on the evidence, I do believe her, then Whitman's a hypocrite. The second issue is, did Whitman somehow abuse her? All right, look, the only piece of evidence that they give is that sometimes Nikki would work she was supposed to work 15 hours a week, and sometimes she'd work longer. But Whitman, Whitman wouldn't necessarily pay for the extra time. <laughs> okay, look, I'm not going to get into the details of your contractual business with your, you know, the person keeping your house. Come on, come on. That's not a real issue, right? So now, as for, but so you can judge for yourself. We have Nikki with the press conference, with Gloria Allred, with the tears. Go. On Monday, June 22, 2009, Ms. Whitman left me a voice message and said that she had not yet contacted her lawyer. But under no circumstance I was I to show up to work or stop at their house until she had a response. Then, on Wednesday, June 24, 2009, I received her call and she told me, I talked to my lawyer and he told me we cannot do anything for you. She said, I cannot help you. And don't say anything to my children. I will tell them you already have a new job and that you want to go to school and from now on you don't know me and I don't know you. You never have seen me and I have never seen you. Do you understand me? And then I said, Meg, please, can you help me? And she was very upset and said, No, and you don't know me, and I have never seen you, and you've never seen me. She yelled, Understand me? I was crying and saying, Yes, and she hung me up, me. I was shocked and hurt that Miss Whitman would treat me this way after nine years. I realized at that moment that she didn't appreciate my work. I felt like she was throwing me away like a piece of garbage. I don't feel like I deserve to be treated this way. She treated me as if I was not a human being. I'm doing this because I know there are a lot of Megs out there who are mistreating the Nikis who worked so hard for them. I hope that no one else in my position has to suffer the way that I did. Oh, come on. 
Oh, come on. Oh, please, Gloria. Please. No, no. Okay, I'm going to be the bad guy. Okay. On that count, did Meg Whitman abuse her, etc.? Not guilty. Okay. She has, she says she tr treated me like a piece of garbage and threw me out. Now, look, should she have fired her, you know, somebody who'd been with her for nine years and said, I can't help you, etc.? You know, I, I would hope that you would treat people a, a little bit more decently like that. But did she, according to her, uh, Nikki, she felt exploited, disrespected, humiliated, and emotionally and financially abused. No, come on, wait a minute. You just, okay, look, here's what happened. You used to work 15 hours a week there. Now you don't. No, no, all the crying. I, look, if I believed it, then I'd feel bad for her. I don't believe her. I, Gloria Allred is pumping her arms. Oh, cry, cry. We're going to get money from Meg Whitman. We're going to cash in. And by the way, I don't know how they don't auto-tune that. That's got to happen tomorrow, okay? You don't know me, and I don't know you. i never seen you, and you never seen me. Okay, that's coming. It's coming, okay? So, no, not buying it. And you know what's going to happen at the end? Gloria Allred is going to get this poor woman kicked out of the country. She's undocumented, okay? She's going to bring this case trying to cash in. Maybe Allred gets her, you know, piece of the pie here. And then what's going to happen? They're going to be like, wait, you, you're here illegally, and they're going to kick her out of the country. It's a terrible idea, okay? So, look, if you thought Meg Whitman was the champion of making sure you get tough on immigration, no more illegal immigrants, you know that's a joke. You know she's a hypocrite. And you know she was never going to bust the employees that hire undocumented workers like herself. But if you think she abused this woman because you trust Gloria Allred and the crying press conference, I'm not with you on that. Not buying it at all.